Hi everyone, Officer Protak here. Hi, it's Officer Best. We're down at the Catasauqua Playground under the gazebo. Um, it was a nice day to get out. It's not too hot, not too humid, it's a bit overcast. So we thought, well, there was a breeze down here. We came to enjoy that breeze. Absolutely. So today's book is gonna be Froggy Learns to Swim. It was hot, like today. <laughs> it was a great day for a swim, said Froggy's mother. So Froggy and his parents flopped outside to the pond. Flop, flop, flop. On your mark, get set, go! Froggy's father sailed in. Splash! Froggy's mother sailed in. Splash! But where was Froggy? Froggy! Called his mother. What? Come on in and swim. No, no. I don't know how to swim. I want to swing. How do you not know how to swim? He's a frog! That's like a fish that can't swim. That's like a moose who's cold. <laughs> we sang Froggy, swinging higher and higher. He swung so high, he almost touched the sky. He swung so high, he went round and round the crossbar. Zing! I always wondered if that was actually possible. It's not possible. <laughs> Unless you have... Um, hard chains coming down because your chain will buckle. You will never make it over the top. Not possible. Not for us it's not. No, not nope, possible. Not for us. We're not trying it either. Then unwound like a spring, zing, and flew through the air. Right smack into the pond. Splash! What are you d doing? asked Froggy's mother. I'm drowning, said Froggy. Help! He grabbed hold of his mother and climbed on. What do you mean you're drowning? Don't you know frogs are born in the water? They are great swimmers. Thank you, Mom Frog. Absolutely. Not me, Bubble Froggy. I can't swim. Oh, fiddlesticks, she said. I'll show you how. Great. And she showed Froggy how saying chicken airplane soldier. Great. Now float on your back and do the frog kick. I won't let go. Then go like this. Do it and repeat after me. Chicken airplane soldier. I don't want to whine Froggy. Oh, come on, Froggy. Just try it. Chicken airplane soldier, rasped Froggy. He gloved and blubbed and almost sank. Mommy, I need my flippers. Then I'll swim. Froggy climbed out and flopped back to his house. He pulled on his flippers, zip, and flopped back to the pond. Flop, flop, splash! Now try it again, said Froggy's mother. Bubble, bubble, toot, toot. Chicken airplane soldier. He gloved and blubbed and almost sank. Mommy, I need my mask and snorkel. Then I'll swim. Froggy climbed out and flopped back to his house. He pulled on his mask and snorkel, zook, zick, and flopped back to the pond. Flop, flop, splash! Now, one more time, said Froggy's mother. 
Bubble, bubble, toot, toot, chicken airplane soldier. I'm really sitting here that. trying to figure out what I don't is really a understand that con- I don't understand that concept, but <laughs> they're frogs. What are you going to do? Yeah, I'm not so sure I understand it either. Trying to and then it that. happened. Oops, spluttered Froggy. What's the matter, asked his mother. Oh, nothing, he said, looking more red in the face than green. Well, it's getting cold, Froggy. It's time to get out. No, no, I can't get out. Why not? Uh-oh. Well, and he blubbered underwater while she crawled out. Then he burst up for air and yelled, Wait! What is it? asked his mother. My bathing suit, he shouted. Don't look, I'm getting out. Froggy climbed out and yanked on his bathing suit with a zap of elastic. Then he pulled on his flippers and sailed back into the pond. Flop, flop, splash. Yeah, that would not be fun. Make sure your bathing suits are on the right way and tight. (laughs) We don't want them to fall off in the water. Froggy, called his mother. Why? I told you it's time to get out. No, no. I don't want to get out. I want to swim. Froggy's mother shook her head. I told you frogs are great swimmers, she said, and sat down with Froggy's father to watch him. And Froggy sang, Bubble, bubble, toot, toot, chicken airplane soldier. All night long. Swim. And that is Froggy Learns to Swim. So I decided you're going to read all the froggy books from now on because your voice impressions are perfect. I love them. Oh, boy. <laughs> so he's going to be the cupcake, mouse, uh, pig, moose, and muffin, and the froggy book readers for us and Dr. Seuss. Don't go to the zoo. Just come visit me. <laughs> Absolutely. I'm like a petting zoo all in one. <laughs> so we hope that you enjoyed the froggy. Um, and if you don't know how to swim, it's nothing to be embarrassed of. There are a lot of people that don't know how to swim. Um, not everybody grows up around water, so you're not going to learn to swim if you don't have water around you. Right. Um, and you're never too old to learn. I know people that are in their 40s that just learn to swim. So don't ever get discouraged if you can't swim. Um, it's pretty easy to learn. So. Yep. Except this year we are on a pool. Yeah. But they're working on it. Hopefully Absolutely. by next year we'll have a lot more people down here, a lot mm-hmm. of people learning how to swim. And I believe the YMCA offers swimming lessons, yeah, so you can always get too. swimming lessons from the YMCA and they bring you down to the pool and yep. a lot of lifeguards here, so. A lot of fun down here. Absolutely. So stay well, stay safe, and most importantly, wash, wash your, your hands. hands. Bye. Bye.